She needs some hope. Some reason to live. All this time on the road, it's been hard. Makes me wish I had better boots, you know? All this time on the... Our farm. Everything we owned. It's all gone. You'll hear our story repeated around Rivenspire, I expect. The roads just aren't safe anymore. Bandits from the Orc's Finger ruins hit our farm. They slaughtered livestock and looted the place. We only escaped because we hid. Then we ran. Until the next disaster befalls us. Marion. She lost her necklace. A family heirloom. You look capable. I have to stay with her, get her to Shornhelm. Would you go after these bandits? Try to find her necklace. Thank you for even considering this. Look for us in Shornhelm if you find it. The necklace. It's been in her family for hundreds of years. I think that necklace meant more to her than the farm. Bitter hand bandits. Bitter bastards, more like it. Trouble for everyone these days. If my brother Adold were here, we could have fought them off. But I couldn't take them on by myself. Not with Marion to protect. He's living a good life as a merchant in Eastmarch. We used to be quite a pair. Fought back to back across the face of Tamriel. But then I met Marion and settled down. Adold went soft and became a fishmonger. Keep your voice down. No, we're not married. We've been together for years, but I can never find the moment. And with her broken up like this, well, that moment isn't now. Funny name for a dreadful place, isn't it? It's one of those alien ruins you find scattered about the region. The Bitter Hand took it over recently. Been using it as a base ever since. Story goes that there was an orc warrior long ago that came through the region looking for spoils and battle. He met his end in the ruin, dead at the hands of an alien lich. Only thing they found of him? His finger bone. They named Stark. As soon as Marion is rested, we're going to head for Shornhelm. Try to put this all behind us. Thank you for even considering this. Look for us in Shornhelm if you find it. The necklace. It's been in her family for hundreds of years. I think that necklace meant more to her than the farm. As soon as Marion is rested. I heard you talking to Lothson. Don't worry, I'll be fine. The big galoot has it in his head. I'm some fragile thing. But it would be nice to have the necklace back. <laughs> yes. The Bitter Hand has been skulking about the farmlands for some time now. I knew they'd hit the farm sooner or later. Just figured on it being later, you know? That's what Lothson keeps telling me. He was telling me to hold on. We'll find hope soon. My mother didn't raise me to be some simpering daggerfall flower. I've been working a farm since I could hold a shovel. I'll live. My great-grandmother's great-grandmother had it made. To celebrate her joining some forgotten king's court, my mother told me. I just know it's been worn by every woman in my family for generations. I'd hate to lose it forever. I heard you talking to Lothson.
Not sure what's more surprising. That we made it to Shornhelm, or that you did? Did you find Marion's necklace? Shaw's bones, you did it! <laughs> Thank you. With this, Marion will make a full recovery. I know it. I may even get up the nerve to ask for her hand. <laughs> Neither of us will forget your kindness. Did I hear that right? You went looking for my necklace. You found it and brought it back? The aid preserve us! Oh, thank you! And if that lovable Galoop doesn't ask me to marry him, I will! You just wait. Did I hear that? Neither of us will forget your kindness. 